another episode of Jurassic World the Game! The longest running series on the history of YouTube. That's probably not right, but it's definitely in the top 10, I feel. I'd be very surprised if there is someone making a series that's been going since 2014, 15? I think it was... Well, it must have been 2015, right? Must have been 15, not 14. Came out just before the movie came out, so we're, we're talking, you know... I mean, it's 2024 now, I'm assuming, when I'm making this video. It's actually New Year's Eve when I'm recording it. But I'm assuming that... We, we could say that's five, six, that's nine years. Nine years! Whoop. Before we know it, we'll be celebrating its 10-year anniversary. That's crazy. It could go, it's, a, it's at school now. It's, it's at school definitely now. Uh, so, let's have a look. What have we got in store? So, luckily... Uh, in, in Jurassic World Alive, Jurassic World The Game, Ludio and Jam City, be very generous, they've given us some good prizes, some good Christmas presents and stuff, um, and they gave me, that they, they seem to flip-flop, uh, I don't know what, uh, goes through their head when they decide to give me the season pass, or the, the, you know, the VIP pass, and then they don't other seasons, but luckily, they gave me one for Christmas, so that's good. <laughs> um, so, no, don't get Dino, we've got lots to fuse, but this guy has been in here for ages, and finally... I put it in accidentally. Uh, we have a Toro level 21 to 30. What's the difference? Well, he just gets stinkier. Like, look at that. Look at the glow. There you go. A level 30 Toro. 975 health. A 914 attack. And one more level, and it'll get even more cool glowy. All right. And we'll have a quick check and gain some books. Just like other Conotauruses, Toro weighs 4,800 pounds. This is approximately the same size as a fully grown rhinoceros. Wow. You know, for something that's way bigger than a rhino, rhinos are chonky, man. <laughs> I think we forget about that. Oh, who'd win an elephant or a, or a Conotaurus? Probably an elephant, let's be honest. We'd just step on it and crush it. Uh, anyway, anyway. Uh, yes. So the new VIP thing I have in here is the Styracosaurus. I think it might be Lux. Lux. Because in Jurassic World Alive, Styracosaurus Lux was a special hoodie doo -dah. Um, So I have, as you can see, 8,980. Oh, and I haven't clicked it. I haven't clicked it so it's going to go beep, 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 and do it all. That's the best bit. Let's be honest. That's the best bit about these. Um, but we do have some other things to do. So win a battle without swapping a dinosaur. That's 500. Uh, complete age. We can't do that. Can't do the gyrosphere. Um, purchase 30 tickets. Hatch Cenozoics. PvP 20 times. And open so many packs. So what I will do is just win some battles without swapping. Um, oh, also, fingers crossed. I'm gonna, you know, I don't think I have a Montasaur unlocked, actually. If we have a look at my dinosaurs, we go to herbivores, we scroll down, and Montasaur, are you there? Oh, maybe I do have you, and Montasaur, yes, I do. Are you unlocked, though? Can I buy another one? No. Okay, so this tournament must unlock it. Yeah, so this is, a, right, we need to get this, because I think it unlocks it. Because it's a tournament creature. So I don't know how, how I have one. I might have bought it in some sort of trade. So we definitely need to do this one so we can get level 40. Um, and Montasaur is kind of a boring dinosaur, not going to lie. Uh, we also have some of these battles. So we've got the combat countdown. You know, we'll do this one because it's like, oh, any dinosaur. Um, I mean, as long as it does 255 damage and it's not a herbivore, we good. So we'll just put Ichthyostega in and just instantly kill these guys. No swaps. We just do two of these. We'll also win the pack. And then we'll get the Styraxor Lux. Because Styraxor's Lux, I've got my four instant hatches. So, of course, we'll go do that, dear. So, has everyone had a good Christmas, New Year, all the other holidays around about the same sort of time? Kind of represent the same sort of thing. I don't know. I'm naive. <laughs> Celebrate all the holidays. Uh, right, let's just scroll down. We'll quickly, we'll here, quickly kill Columbo with a patchy Ceratops. Level 21! Why don't I have this thing at level 30? Well, we're going to feed it after this. Watch me forget. Patchy Ceratops, patchy Ceratops. We will feed patchy Ceratops, patchy Ceratops, patchy Ceratops. Where's <laughs> it? Let's quickly finish these guys off. Maybe with the last battle, it'll be a bunch of different things. Oh, as you notice, I'm wearing a lovely, 
wintry jumper. Normally I'm in a hoodie because, you know, it's quite, if it's cold, zip up. It's hot, take it off. It's just cold now, so we just need something we can't zip down. <laughs> uh, oh, it's a three-er. Interesting, interesting. Uh, well, we could have anything, really. Even if you wanted, we could have the Giganotosaurus Gen 2. Yeah, go on then. Let's have you. Let's throw you in here. Level 40. Did I even put this in a thumbnail? I don't think I did. The Giganotosaurus Gen 2. It is a freaking horn on its head. Looks so cool. We, I mean, we definitely leveled it up. But I do not remember putting it in a thumbnail. Um, but really, we're going to be doing this Styracosaurus. Hopefully, we can get... We should be get a level 20. We should be get... Oh my god. Oh, oh, sorry. I apologize. My English is um, exponentially getting worse. All right. <laughs> As time goes on. Yeah, look at it. It looks so cool. There's a little horn. It's like a giant ceratosaurus. And we'll do one final one. Aha. Okay. So, I don't know. Indoraptor. Current team, you need. No, I. I do not need more than one, my dear. This is Indoraptor in this game. In Jurassic World Alive, it's kind of terrible. <laughs> but in this one, it's quite good. Ooh, ooh. Oh, no, Granlong. No. Did, like, so much damage. 6,000 damage. And finally, Columbo. Meow. And again, honestly, if we can just get a rotation of different arenas. That would be so nice, Ludia. Uh, Gem City. I don't know which overlord I should be praying to. I've got multiple deities now. Uh, Raptor Jesus being one of them. Jam City. Jam City. Why jam? Like, like, do you like jam? Is, was, was that out of love? And City. <laughs> right, so combat counter. We could get something good in here. Let's see. Uh, we didn't, but we do get the guaranteed books and DNA, which is good. Another Giganotosaurus. Uh, crazy that we've got Gen 2, which is, you know, Dominions, and then the normal Giganotosaurus. So, that should have done the 500. Oh, boom. Another reward, and... Ooh, close, close, close. Uh, so I think what... At 9,000 points, we are past the normal rewards. I think the max is about 1,600. So we're on to the next bit, where... Because we are VIP exclusive, or, you know, the better one, VIP+, plus, uh, we're going to get rewards each stage. If you're not, you get re rewards like every 500 or something ridiculous. It's a big, big difference. Or every 1,000. Um, so, are you ready? Are you ready, guys? We're, we're going to go straight through. We're going to go ready. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And actually, we're not. Oh, it's 10,000 to get the next guaranteed. Ah, uh, we're close. We're close. Uh, another 520 points, and boom, we would have another Styracosaurus. It is called Styracosaurus, looks okay. So do we get anything that's quite interesting here? Uh, oh yeah, I've got to look at the top as well. Oh, I've been spoiled. I'm, always, I'm used to looking at the bottom. So have we got any other guaranteed or chances? Because if there's a chance to get one... Oh, glowing spines. Is that guaranteed? No, it's 5% chance. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, what do we think? 5%? That's a really low percent, but let's go. Glowing spines. Our survey says... Uh, well, you know what? It's a silver. It's a stegosaurus. It could be a lot worse. It could be a rare or a common. Okay, so that's... Oh, and that's the only... Ooh. We do have a biosyn fountain. Oh, that's cool. I want to get that. Give me that. I want to place that one down. And anything at the bottom? There's a glowing spines. No... I tell you what, I'll take the Apatosaur, because I have that for the trade harbors. Um, anything else interesting? Apart from Diplodocus, no. Uh, glowing Spines. Oh, you get Parasaur Gen 2 in here? What? And an instant hatch for it? Ooh. Ooh. This goes all the way to 20,000. Oh, my God. Okay, so one, two, three... Uh, four. So you've got a guaranteed five if you get the grand premium. F five. I, I honestly feel like if you do the grand premium, you should be able to guarantee a level 40. Because you can't get these. You don't unlock them. I don't know. That, that That's my two cents anyway. You know, if you're spending money on this, you should be able to get that. So let's hatch. Because when we hatch a, a Styracosaurus Lux. We get a guaranteed uh, mission, I think. 
Yeah, look at you! You've come so far! Look at that. One of uh, many dinosaurs that have done reverse. They've came from Jurassic World Alive rather than coming from this game to Jurassic World Alive. Uh, so let's feed you at level 10. 483 health and 300 attack. Ooh, a herbivore that has a good, uh, like, attack ratio in comparison to its health. Interesting. It exhibits bioluminescence, a natural glow in the dark. Well, maybe at uh, Evo 40 it does, but right now it doesn't. Uh, we'll quickly just get that, get some extra stuff. We're getting close to a million DNA again. Of course, that's a gradual thing. It's going to take time. Uh, so we do that. We should have got this mission. Another 200 takes us to our next reward. We need to get 10,000 in order to get that, though. So boom. So close. So close. Uh, how, how much longer do we have on this? We have 19 days. So we've got to fuse 25 creatures. We've got to have a level 20 Styracosaur Lux. And of course, we've got all these extra missions as well. As these guys. Like, weekly, of course, we've got at least another two to three weeks. Uh, no, two weeks of refreshed weekly rewards. Uh, we'll do the lottery as well. Oh god, I am zoomed in. <laughs> lottery! Uh, oof. I mean, is, is it good? I, I usually just do these anyway. I don't think they're really worth it, but for 10, sure, why not? Um, is there anything else? <gasps> Pachyceratops. Almost forgot there, but no! I'm not that uh, yeah, stupid, maybe. Just a little bit. Oh yeah, we have Dodo! I forgot about that. Um, right. Patchy Ceratops, you will be a hybrid. I've definitely passed you. Uh, you're gonna be around here. <gasps> I spy with my little eye something that begins- Why are you not alphabetical? What's this mean? Like, what does this mean? I'm so confused if I do that. There's you. Okay, okay. Why is Patchy- Oh no, there it is! Ha ha ha! Oh, we have- we have a- ooh, I'll get the level 30, sure. We also have a level 20, so we'll get that. So at level 30, it has 1,775 health and 454 attack. Almost on par with a level 10 Styracosaurus Lux. We'll also claim that to get some extra free books. Like the Nazuceratops, the Patchy Ceratops has the same signature neck frill. Its back is also heavily armored with fused plates. Wait, it has the same neck frill as a Nazuceratops? I don't know if you've seen a Nazuceratops in a long time, but that definitely does not. Uh, oh, tell you what, I got one of those Co 19s the other day for 500 DNA. I was like, oh, I got it, and it was 700. I, I perfected it. So I was quite pleased with myself there. So, I mean, the only thing really left to do is just to try and do the Ammonosaurus. If we've got any other good packs to get before they expire, is a question. Oh, yeah, also, every time we do it, we've got this, which eventually, you know, you can fight for the Mastodon, a guaranteed, as well as 500 bucks. So that is good too. Uh,. We've got three battles of this. Oh, Lord. Uh, that is super tough. What about hybrids rare? Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, you know what? I think I think we might be able to do this. Can it kill? It can kill us in one hit. That's good. All we need to do is just one massive amount of attacks with Carnoraptor, and we can do this. We'll also have a look. To see what the uh, infinite pack is as well. So I will switch out. We'll bring in our own at level 20. Do two. I was hoping... Uh, it can't kill me in two. So that would be good if it did. Oh! There you go. So we won. Good. Because our attack is now 500. We kill it in... Maybe three? One, two, three. Yo, we didn't. Wow. Okay. If it went for two block, wouldn't have done it there. So super easy. That's good. We'll take the 50 DNA for that. Hybrid's rare. What's next? Ooh, a little bit tougher. A little bit tougher. Um, wait, how many battles are these? Oh, God, they're five. I do not have that many thingies. Um, I think those two can do it. Wait, I need three? Oh, I need to enter three. Okay, well, sort that. Let's do the battle stage infinite. <laughs> oh, that's good. That's good. Okay, mainly carnivores. There is a herbivore there, which poses a little bit of a threat. But we got the level 40 Chroma Spinus there. Entering the top 10. But we need amphibians, and I still don't have any good amphibians up here. Am I missing one? I don't even know. There should be. Carnivore, carnivore, herbivore, carnivore, flyer, carnivore, carnivore, herbivore. Where are... Um, there must be one I'm not... I don't have leveled up yet. 
Um, we'll add Indoraptor, sure. Actually, no, we're not, because it'll die in one hit. We need to make sure we have just enough to survive. And then... Your... Uh, it's, you know what? There's no point me putting in a, a thing here, an amphibian. Because against the Cintasaurus, the Cinta... Cint Cintaurosaurus. There we go. I, I, I do try to pronounce them right. <laughs> um, it, it, there's no point. This has no advantage. So... 5,000. And then we just go for some health tanks. I think a full team... Look at this, though. It looks so cool. It's so nice to see them in this light. Then the visitor center, which is 99.9% .9 of every other battle you do in the game. Oh, it didn't even kill me. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Ooh, should I put the Uteranus in second? Maybe I should have. Ooh. I'm, you know what? I'm really curious as to whether people still play this or they just use my, my, like, they watch these videos and go, yes, I don't need to play the game. You're doing it for me. Because <laughs> I think there's probably a big chunk of my audience watch this for nostalgic reasons <laughs> rather than anything else. It takes you, oh, what, what am I doing? I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm doing some cheeky attacks for no reason. Does it bring you back to a, a nicer time, an easier time when you were in school and you didn't have anything to worry about except for, I don't know, playing Fortnite and, and, and not losing badly so you didn't get picked on at school the next day. <laughs> I remember those times. Although it wasn't Fortnite. It was Halo, Gears of War for me. Uh, or Call of Duty. I swear, I played Call of Duty like once and I impressed my friends because I don't know how I did it. I joined one game, got a helicopter within two seconds. I think it was like a five to 10 kill streak. I don't even know how I managed it, but it, it happened. Uh, and then I just, I was like, oh, sweet. I, they were like, what? You got a helicopter already? And then I never played it again. <laughs> I think it was a fluke. I'm not saying I was good. I think it was a fluke. So I think it went for an all out attack here. So just in case. Okay, that's good. Cause then some towers uh, attack goes down. I do have a lot. It also has a lot of health though. Oh, I'm a bit worried. I'm gonna go for three block here. And two reserve, because I... Yeah, I thought it might have went for six. Yes. Okay, so two for six. Might be just under enough to kill me. Oh, God, please don't kill me. No, oh, I knew it. I knew it. Yes. Now it's my turn. With the might of six attacks. Nom, nom. I love its color, though. It's a blue jay. No, oh, now it's dead. It's a blue dead. Yes. I remember when I did my top ten. And Uteranus was, ooh, is it, is it the new thing? It wasn't out yet. I was like, mm, it would be number one. But it's not officially released yet, so I'm not putting it in. It was about 40,000 bucks, which is ridiculous. Uh, oh, the next one's a good one. Okay. Is there anything that we... Oh, like, if it's use herbivores, use carnivores, or something like that, it's easy to, like, go through them. 15 snow would is easy as well. Not as easy, unless you have a battle event that is only used Cenozoic creatures, but very rarely that happens. It, maybe it's a whiteout, probably that one, but I don't like doing the PVPs. We have no events for VIP. What's happening? Like, not even one. I haven't even done any. I'm pretty sure that I, I haven't done any, and there's just a time where you got VIP, get nothing for it. <laughs> Sweet, cool. Uh, so we have really the Edmondosaurus, and again... I think, I don't know where I was. I think I was in, I just cracked over to Silver League. So I'm assuming I'm back into the Survivor League. I think Silver's Hunter, Hunter League. But again, the tournaments when it comes to this game are just so grindy. It is ridiculous. Um, and again, they're all in a situation where I hate to look at it. It's all so dark. It was one of the last battle arenas I think added. Um, and they've just decided that we're not going to change it. We're going to have every battle in this arena where everything's dark. It's dimly lit. And, you know, it, I hate it. I hate it. It's one of the reasons why I, I despise doing the tournaments. Because one, it's boring. Because it's the same thing over and over again. Uh, and two, it's easy when you know this. Um, like, what I'm doing. Put in two really weak creatures just so you can kind of, when you win... You can get as many cups as you can, just put in the weakest things. Um, 
And also, just the arena sucks. Like, <laughs> they're the three main reasons. I had a dream, actually. I was saying three, and I kept on doing four. I was like, three! Three! And then I was doing, like, two and one. I was like, three! <laughs> Such a weird dream. I remember that now. I completely forgot about it until I did three right there. Uh, very interesting. I remember going... You know, you have... Because you think you know what you're doing, and then it was just like, no. But I... No! <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Anyway. We have one Styracosaurus. I was hoping we'd have two. With the amount of uh, points that I got given. Or I'd uh, saved up there. But apparently not. But in a couple of days uh, from this, we should have the... Oh yeah, also you can't speed up. Because the game tries to make you believe you're, you're fighting against real people. That would be a godsend. If I could just have speed up with the tournaments. Honestly, in real time, I could probably save an hour. And that hour could... I could actually use... <laughs> it's so ridiculous. I hate it. Oh, we got another Co-19. Oh, so 25 there. That's good. And we're back into Hunter League just. Just in a Hunter League. So, yeah. If you don't have... Or you have lots of creatures, that's the best way. Two commons sandwiched between a really good creature that can probably one-shot things. And you'll be fine. But if you've watched my videos for a long time, you probably know that to be the strategy. So let's have a look. We've got a Kendrasaur here. Giving us 305. Shouldn't be too hard to do. I like how my iPad's burning up. It's like... <laughs> Alright. Yeah! I had to concentrate that. <gasps> and then this one, it should have one of the fast tracks at the bottom for the final click, I think. This was a tough one. I always thought that the one that has you do two of the speed trackers at the bottom where you have to click, like the timer ones, they're the hardest. But actually, no. The one I did that was 700 DNA I got for didn't even have that. Okay, and the final one will be one click away. This was 305. Oh, my God. <laughs> ah, no. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. That's a harder one. Uh, the one that was a 700 only had one at the very end. So, do we have a pet creature? So I think I've already done that. Yeah. I never get these boss DNAs. It's always something that, you know, if I played this game, if it was back in 2015, 16, I would do all the missions. You know, we'd do everything. But now, nowadays, I like to focus on um, other sorts of content. We do a lot of the Isle, we do, or try to. We do a lot of Path of Titans, other games that take a lot of time to record, a lot of time to edit. So I don't really have time to just spend hours and hours just grinding a tournament, which is why sometimes I miss... Uh, Dilophosaur Gen 2 is in here twice, and I missed it twice. Uh, not for lack of trying, I just don't have time. Um, and maybe, I think Ludia and Jam City need to focus on things that, you know, aren't as grindy. Because people don't have time. You know, I, I go onto Pokemon Go, I spend 10 to 15 minutes just doing all my dailies, and having fun, and then leaving it. Whereas this is like, no, nah, no, nah, you want to do all your dailies? Give us hours of your time. Don't have hours. So, uh, yeah, I think I think that's why, if anything, this game needs to rethink and rejigger a little bit to make things faster and more enjoyable. Um, because there's so much to do. But anyway, guys, we're going to wrap it up here. Not a super long one. We saw Styracosaurus looks. Was hoping to get level 20. But we're going to hopefully get a Modosaurus and then do all the missions to get as higher level Styracosaur looks as possible. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye bye